Check DLC. That's a lot of content. Hey, Random, thank you so much for the host, brother. I appreciate that. Here we go. Oh, which one do I want to play? Origins or Awakening? Oh, Awakening's the expansion? Okay. Let's go, lads. Let's fucking go, lads. And so is the Golden City blackened with each step you take in my hall. Marvel at perfection for its fleeting. You have brought sin to heaven and doom upon all the world. Canticle of Threnodies 813. The Chantry teaches us that it is the hubris of men which brought the Darkspawn into our world. Hi, cheese. The mages had sought to usurp heaven, but instead they destroyed it. They were cast out, twisted and cursed by their own corruption. They returned as monsters, the first of the Darks. Oh my god! They became a blight upon the lands, unstoppable and relentless. The Dwarven Kingdoms were the first to fall, and from the deep roads, the Dark Spawn drove at us again oh, and again, Alexis. until finally we neared annihilation. You flatter me. Pick yourself up, lad. Let's go. Until the Until Grey Wardens the Grey came. Wardens came. Men and women from every race, warriors, warriors and, and mages, mages barbarians, barbarians and kings, kings. the Grey, the Grey Wardens, Wardens sacrificed, sacrificed everything to, to stem the, the tide, tide of darkness and prevailed. Oh, damn! Okay. Oh, get it! Oh! 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 It has been four centuries since, since that, that victory. victory. And we and have we kept, kept our vigil. vigil. We have we watched, have watched and, waited and waited for the dark spot to return. return. But those, but those who, who once called, called us heroes, heroes have forgotten. We are few now, and our and warnings, warnings have, have been, been ignored, been ignored, for, ignored too long. for too long. You don't fuck with me. No, oh, get wrecked. Oh, oh, okay. This is Sparta. For I have seen with my own eyes what lies on the horizon. This guy looks like a Duncan. Or Declan. Maker, help us all. I don't know why. That guy's like straight up reminds me of Highlander. He looks like a Duncan or a Declan. His name is Duncan? <laughs> no way. Please tell me his name is actually Duncan. Holy fuck, that's funny. I was like, that, that guy straight up reminds me of Highlander. He looks like Duncan or Declan. <laughs> that's that's good. That's good shit. Are you magic? Uh, I mean, that just like that name fits. Sometimes you can see someone and, and you can see a name that like fits with them, and that's I don't know. It just made me think of like Duncan McLeod. <laughs> that's so wild. The background you select will determine which of the six distinct opening stories you play through. It also affects how characters respond to you throughout the game. 
Ok. My name is Duncan McLeod of Clan McLeod. Well, okay. I'm magic. <laughs> right? Um, let's see. Well, okay, I think I'm, I'm going to play female. Yeah, pretty sure I'm just going to play a lady. Also depends on how people talk to you. When Bub knows your name just from looking at you? I mean, you just got to size a person up, right? I don't know why, I just... That name just kind of, like, screamed to me. Maybe I'd heard that. Maybe someone said something in the past. He just looked like a Duncan or a Declan or, like, a Deacon or something like that. I don't know, but his name just screamed D. Just David Denton Duncan Declan something like that. Plus, you know, he's got a sweet beard. My name's David, and I've got a I've got a sweet beard. So, like, I just was the, I was thinking like on the D wavelength. You know what I'm saying? Okay, so race human, the most numerous yet most divided of all the races. Only four times have they ever united under a single cause. The last being centuries ago. Religion and the Shantry play a large part in human society. It distinguishes it distinguishes them culturally from elves and dwarves more than anything else. Humans can be warriors, rogues, or mages. Plus one strength, plus one dex, plus one magic, plus one cunning. Elves are just short people here. Alright. Once enslaved by humans, most elves have all but lost their culture, scrounging in impoverished living in the slums of human cities. Only the nomadic Dalish tribes still cling to their traditions, living by the bow and the rule of their old gods as they roam the ancient forests. Welcome nowhere else. Elves can be warriors, rogues, or mages. Plus two willpower, plus two magic. Does he have big donk energy? He definitely does. Do you ever roll the dice for your builds for video games? I tend not to. No. I tend not to. His name screams the D. It does, though. Oh, my God. Look at this thick and juicy. Oh, Lord. She got, she got some trunk on her. All right. I've always been predisposed to playing dwarves anyway. I just, I've always liked dwarves. So, let's see. Uh, rigidly bound. Their arms are fucking freakishly long. I don't feel like that's accurate. <laughs> oh my god, her arms are so long! They put the human's arms on a dwarf's body! She's reaching her knees without bending over. <laughs> oh my god! Look at that! Good lord. She could could you imagine her driving like driving a car and then just reaching around to slap someone? She could slap someone two or three rows away with that fucking arm, dude. <laughs> oh my god. Plus one strength, one dex, plus two con. Ten chance to resist hostile magic. Pretty much, quiz. Pretty much. Uh-oh. Phone call. One moment, guys. Help me decide here. What do you think? Okay, all right. Female dwarf with a nimble origin? I always like that the arms are made, the dwarves are a little different from the... They, are, they definitely are very different, right? Like, their arms are so long, man. Like, they, they are ape... They're like, they're ape people, man. Like, knuckles down in the dirt. These are some straight-up ape people. Um, I don't know. I feel... Least attached to the elves, more attached to humans. What do humans get? I don't know, I'm not really sold on the magic. And they get a 10% chance to resist hostile magic? Let's just try Dwarf. Let's see what we got here. 
Warriors are powerful fighters, focusing on melee and ranged weapons to deal with their foes. They can withstand and deliver a great deal of punishment. Strong understanding of tactics and strategy. Specializations for a warrior include Berserker, Templar, Champion, and Reaver. Okay, what do we have for this? Rogue. Rogues are skilled adventurers who come from all walks of life. All rogues possess some skill in picking locks and spotting traps, making them valuable assets to any party. Tactically, they are not ideal frontline fighters, but if rogues can circle around behind their target, they can backstab to devastating effects. Rogue specializations are Ranger, Bard, Duelist, and Assassin. Plus four dex, plus two willpower, plus four cunning. That's plus four strength, plus three dex, plus three con. All right, I've got to know something before I move forward with, with either of these classes. If I... If I decide that I want to play ranged, like if I want to play a ranged uh, dwarven rogue, um, and I'm, like maybe I'm using, a, I'm not even sure. There's probably an archer in the game. I don't really remember the characters um, at all. Um, I know my wife said that there is like a healer class. And there's a witch, sorceress. I'm not really sure. Um, she's kind of told me some things, but. If I play range, would it be better for me to go rogue or for me to go warrior? Rogue or warrior? You can use melee and ranged. Go rogue. Rogue has archery skill. Okay. All right. Thank you. That's what I needed to know. Dwarf commoner. Dwarven Noble. Commoner. Noble. Commoner. Noble. All right, what do you guys think? I'm gonna I'm gonna let you guys decide here. You 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 vote. All right. If you want Dwarf Commoner, press 1. If you want Dwarf Noble, press 2. I'm going to give you guys an opportunity to vote. Lord, okay. All right. Twos are coming in hot. 47 does not fit, Greymane. That's a lot of two. That's a lot of twos. All right, I think twos are going to run with this one. 1, 2, 3, 4... 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, versus 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Yeah, I think uh, I think Noble's going to run away with it. I think a commoner would be more likely to be a rogue. I mean, yeah, it's, that's that's probably fair, fair assessment, but I'm not really trying to go like a, a super roguish route. I want to go down the route of like ranged and with the, the dex build. But I'm not really sure if range goes off dexterity. I never met a noble who stole all your money. I don't know, y'all. <laughs> oh, it's true, though, man. It's true. Listen, we're going to build a dwarf. And she's huge. Okay, she's very thick. And huge. We're going to build a dwarf. Greetings. Greetings. Oh God! What is <laughs> what is this face, man? Oh, she just looks like a little kid. <sighs> this woman's name is Dale. This woman's name is Dale. I mean, Dale Gribble. All right, so we're not going to run with any of the presets. Let's just check some shit out here. Lord, okay. All right, so they don't really do that much. All right. Yeah, that's fine. 
blush color. I do like the green around her eyes. Blush intensity. This is, this is, I'm sorry, you guys just walked into character creation. Y'all done messed up. Tattoos, eh? It's kind of wild. I dig it. I hope she's going to be a spy. Oh, man. Well, we're not going to be doing that. Well, hold on. Flood. Ooh, okay. Oh, I kind of dig. I like that. It looks like very faint. Yeah. Hi. Whoa. Hey. Hi. Hello. <clears throat> I'm doing character creation. Okay. What do you mean? Am I still on that? You hush your mouth. Naysaying ass. Take the cookie. No, I don't want to play Dale. Can I turn her around? Oh my god, she's got... My anaconda don't want none, alright? Um, what? Look. Unless you got buns, hon. Oh, goodness. I might be ridiculous, but you love it. Only a little. I kind of like that. Yeah, I kind of dig that. Man, they really want you to go, like, red. Oh. Oh, my God. Lacey. I'm just making Leslie. <laughs> I'm just making my own wife. <clears throat> just making my wife, guys. Didn't even realize it. Thank you, baby. Yeah, I'll. Yes, I will. Eyebrow color. Perfect. They can't see me. Eyes. Oh lord. I actually like the eyes already. Maybe fix the brows a little bit. This is what my wife normally looks like because I constantly piss her off. <laughs> So let's put her somewhere right in the middle, where she probably belongs. <clears throat> Make your wife into the epic rogue dwarf and watch her <laughs> wreck people. <laughs> Brow depth. Stay a while and listen. Magic man, thank you so much, man. I appreciate that. Bubbles. What's up? Man, I'm gonna have to fix that nose. That nose is bothering me. She got a button nose. She don't got a big old nose like that. Yeah, Liz has got a bit of a button nose. Yeah, I like that though. I think that's very fitting. Nose! <laughs> she got a little button nose. Yeah. Dang, dude, my wife's cute. She's a cutie. 
it probably goes about right there. There's depth. Mm -mm. Yeah, from the side that doesn't quite look right. Because mm -mm. it's a bit more stern than that. Bridge depth. There we go. Whoa, holy! No, no. Bridge width. At least you're not making Arya Stark. That's. Well, I think that's kind of boring. pretty good. <laughs> what do you think? Nose that big? <laughs> she doesn't like a Crypt Keeper nose. What up, Fist? What's going on, buddy? Hey, V. How you doing, bud? Mouth is pretty good. Lip size... I don't know, I think it's pretty fair where it's at, right? I'm pretty happy with it, actually. All Like, all in all. Let's choose her voice. No, it is gone! How do you do? What's up with her teeth? Damn, lost the spell. Fucking awful. Yeah, her fucking teeth look rough. Greetings. Greetings. Charmed. Greetings. Charmed. It didn't work. Oh, bother. I need something new. Greetings. Oh, my spell! What does it take to kill these things? Oh, yeah. That's vi That's, yeah, that's <laughs> violent. That's, there's my wife. All right. <laughs> Leslie, right there. Next. Also, the teeth and... <laughs> they suck. Uh, let's see. We want to... What does Dexterity do for us? Higher Dexterity improves the character's chances to hit, makes the character more likely to dodge incoming blows, and contributes to the damage dealt by piercing weapons such as daggers or arrows. So this is very, like, spot on to my life. Archery and dual weapon fighting demand high dexterity to master. Hmm. Well, power represents a determination. No, we're not going to mess with spells. Mm -mm -mm. Cunning seems really good. So I think we go... Constitution is probably health. So let's go two. Two and one. What do you guys think? <clears throat> Two, two, and one. What, baby? You want the pickle that bad? Oh my god, you're a heathen. <laughs> Your skills are spells? Okay. You gotta, you gotta give them context. It's an actual pickle. <laughs> Dex, cunning, and willpower? Why willpower? Oh, it's... Okay, it's stamina. Well, that seems... Shitter. Okay.
I have one point to spend. Stealing, trap making, survival, herbalism. Gain a combat tactic slot? What the hell's the point of that? Well, lockpicking doesn't really seem to be a thing right now. Unless it's slotted under stealing or trap making. Herbalism. So I've got poison make. I can make poisons and I have combat training. It's under stealing. Okay. Dirty fighting. Below the belt. Deft hands. We want there we go. That's what I want. Archery. Pinning shot. So we're going to go melee archer and rapid shot. Deep beneath the frostback mountains sits Ozamon. I'll figure it out, Zach. I'm not too worried about it. Two known remaining dwarven cities in the world. Other way, stealing is okay. I'm not too mad about that. A major empire connected by tunnels called deep roads which stretched thousands of miles. The and city now stands alone, cut off from the rest of the dwarven ancestral lands by the darkspawn incursion. Secure in Orzammar's impregnable construction, the dwarven noble houses continue their centuries-old power struggles. Assassination and blackmail are commonplace. But the appearance of honor is paramount. You are the second child of King Endron of House Idukan, the ninth Idukan ruler elected by the Noble Assembly. Idukan! You grew up in a world rife with political intrigue and have struggled against brothers and cousins for honor and prestige. Today, a feast celebrates your first military commission, the opening move towards real power in the ever-changing game of Dwarven politics. Greetings, my lady. You are dressed and ready. Excellent. Ooh, she's pretty. I couldn't find the armor's matching dagger, but I scrounged up a rather fancy longsword. Do you wish to wear your shield to the noble's feast? Do I have to choose a number, or...? You have to choose what you say to him. <clears throat> Yes, let me see them as a warrior. Better safe than sorry shield me. Leave it. I don't want to look fearful. I wouldn't even wear the armor if not tradition. Oh boy. Okay. Um. Better safe than sorry. Shield you sure me. that's all you want me to do to you? Excuse me? Whoa! Whoa! He's already hitting on you. I need you I need you to calm down. I need to dial it back a notch. Alright, Captain Codpiece? Fuck. Like that's my wife. <laughs> Close the door and show me what you're thinking. Random gray maid is I need an adult. <laughs> We've been down this road, Gorham. Let it go. You, my friend, are ridiculous. One can't take all this marching about and speech making too seriously. Moving on to the business at hand. The king expects you to make an appearance at the feast, but there's no rush. The noble family heads will spend hours boring your father with petitions and petty grievances. What sort of grievances? The usual. This lord had my cousin killed. This lord seduced my wife. This lord did the exact thing I'd planned to do to him, but he did it first. They pose and bluster, and each pretends he's oh, that's the honorable Steve man in a den of thieves and assassins. Bah. The rest is worth seeing, though. That's Steve Blum. As part of the celebrations, permits have been auctioned off to members of the merchant caste who wish to sell wares in the Diamond Quarter. Lord Harrowmont has also opened up the provings for young warriors to test their metal before tomorrow's battle. Rumor has it that Harrowmont hopes you'll be swept off your feet if a well-placed young nobleman wins the provings in your honor. I mean, I can, but... 
at the same time, right, like it doesn't make a whole lot of difference if I'm reading them out, right? <clears throat> if I'm actually reading it out, it shouldn't matter. I could use a little sweeping off my feet. Perhaps I'll go in the proving myself. Paramount. Perhaps I'll go in that proving myself. Win yeah. the proving in your own honor. That would be most interesting. Shall we then? Are you choosing the answer you think Leslie would say? No. Yes, let's head to the Brubings, or I'd like to see the merchants. Oh, I don't have money, do I? With you as always, my lady. The day is ours until the feast. I think we'd be played from a variety of tactical viewpoints. Use the mouse wheel to bring your camera down. What do you mean? Oh, okay. Okay, that's cool. I can dig that. It's a lack of cash stopping from picking up a few things at the market, yeah? Character now's move order. You can issue orders in real time or while paused, press space to unpause. I think I need all of that shit. Do I need it all? Oh, take it all itself. That's fair. Wow. Whoa. That's bizarre. It wanted me to remove that item specifically. Like, here's your chance. Now you see you're naked. Snap, she's thick though, right? Yeah, she is. She's a little thick in the middle. Alright guys, I'm gonna finish my food real quick before we go into this. Do I? Blood dragon plate? What? No, I don't think so, not yet. Misa like thick. <laughs> yeah, give me just a second, guys. I'm gonna finish eating first. They can't see you. <laughs> I don't need it yet. Game takes time. Thank you, Aurora. that I don't listen to bots bots are stupid mm -mm -mm. I think you don't have all the item DLCs which isn't too important her arms to be a, no her arms are crazy long Dennis holy shit down to her knees. Oh yeah, her fingertips touch her kneecaps, which is nuts. What up, Brock? What's going on, man? Welcome in, guys. Mm -mm -mm. Good. This 
what I needed. Oh my god. <laughs> Thank you guys for being patient as well. Well, you know what they say about dwarven lasses with long arms, though, eh? I don't, Val. Tell me. I'd like to know. Who doesn't like a lady with long arms? I don't know if Leslie's arms were as long as her arms. I'd be a little weirded out. Yeah, this is the ultimate edition. Just think of seeing that, like, shadowy figure in the night that their arms go down to their knees. And it just starts slowly walking toward you. Mm-mm. Okay. Damn. Damn, it's really nice. She reminds you of a bulky Slenderman? Bokey, I think, <clears throat> I think once a month, I'm going to start putting out a, uh, a reward for my favorite clip. <clears throat> Nothing super crazy, like $20 Steam gift card or something like that, but I feel like I should reward people for, for getting the best clip like that. You put in a ton of work on, on clips and stuff, and maybe it's, it'll be encouraging to other people to do the same. Either way, it could be fun. Plus, it could be a way to give back to you guys. Yes. Yes, Phelan. Bubby, get back to us so much already. I wish I could get more, to be honest. Hmm? We'll see. And now my favorite point! The cookies. Say that one more time. Oh, yes. So this cookie is delicious, and I have to explain why. It is the only place that I found makes a lemon drop cookie with a very low amount of white chocolate and an extreme amount of lemon. Lemon's probably one of my favorite flavors in the world. It's a super soft, like, vanilla blend cookie with high, high lemon content and very low white chocolate to it so it doesn't, like, reverse the palate. It's got a sharpness to it. It's super delicious. It's very good stuff. Mm-mm. Yeah. Yeah, it's not super sweet. It's kind of bitter. It's got a little bit of a bitterness to it. I like it. From Firehouse Subs. Some people weren't here before when you were ordering food. That way they can go try it themselves if they have one near them. Honestly, I just wish they didn't put white chocolate in it at all. Because I just like lemon cookies. Mm -mm -mm. All right. Hmm. Camera's a little weird. <clears throat> that was an awful experience. Didn't spill on me. Didn't spill on any of your stuff. Just on the chair. 
give her a moment. Panic a little bit? A little. Scared the shit out of me. You sure didn't get down the airball? What's up, Jam? What's going on, bud? <clears throat> Did you try Uruguayan Alpha Jor? Or, or, um, Alpha Jor Uruguayo? It's absolutely amazing. I've never even heard of it. I am at your service. Why are you running? I, I'm sorry. I thought you were Prince Balin coming down the hall. I, forgive me. Who are you? What are you doing in my brother's quarters? Gorham, tell her that my brother's at the feast. No harm done. What are you in my brother's quarters? She's, uh, it seems she's one of your brother Balin's newest, um, companions. Prince Balin is attending the feast being held in Lady Iduken's honor. Iduken! Yes, of, of course. <laughs> it was presumptuous of me to think that he would return to... I am sorry. I will show myself out. With your leave, my lady. Go or stay, I don't care. Thank you. I will go now. All right. Your brother's room. Definitely. Just give me a lock picker. A little bizarre, but all right. Actually, surprised there's not more of a direction on this. Short of just going where you would think. Got it. Key required. Rut row raggy. Oh, Orzammar. Orzammar. That's a, that's a wild name. Orzammar Palace. Deny the craftsmanship. It's a plenty. So where the fuck am I going? Is there like a quest log? <sighs> okay, so there's a couple of things on the map that we can investigate. Sure you want to go to the feast now? I doubt we can escape to see the provings once we're inside. Right, let's go see the provings first. I can't wait to see who's fighting today. Okay, so then I guess I go out here. Father has allowed the merchants to show their wares in the Diamond Quarter during these celebrations. Silk merchant, armor merchant. Okay, so then I need to go right now. <clears throat> sure, we can work this out reasonably. Wait a minute, hold on. I think I said I'm sure we can work something out reasonably. Let's talk. Bruton and Volney, and Scholar Gertek. Please, Master Volney. My work is accredited by the Shaper. These books are lies written by the enemies of House Volney. 
I write only what I find in the ancient records. Lady Idukin, you can vouch for my work, can't you? Your father loved my history of Idukin, Paragon King, Peacemaker. What's going on here? This worm has written a book that slanders my house. What does it say? It doesn't matter. It's all lies. Tell me what it says, Scholar. My work tells the stories of all those raised paragons in the last 500 years. When the assembly names a paragon, that man or woman is then, by definition, everything one can aspire to be in the world. They form their own noble houses and are revered as living ancestors. But paragons start off as men. Volney was more than a man. Gets the point. Why is he so Volney angry? Volney became a paragon by the narrowest margin in history. One vote. A vote mired in rumors of intimidation, intrigue, and outright bribery. The records of that vote are kept in the shape of it and are a matter of fact. Not liking history doesn't make it any less true. Yeah, that's, that's accurate. If I had to choose what Leslie would do here in the situation... Scholar's right, my guy. Sorry, Bruton. You're taking his side? What if he published a book like this about your paragon Idukin? The truth is more important than your pride. You would not say so if it was your house. But I shall respect your wishes. For now. Listen, you don't have to be a bitch about it, alright? Climb off your high horse, Bruton. That fool has no idea how weak his house is or how low he sits in it. Shall I have him killed, my lady? Wow. Holy shit. He's not worth a blade. Leave him be. As you say. You've shown House Iduka a friend to research, history, and the glory of our people. Perhaps a sign of your gratitude is in order? Wow. Okay. Um, carry on with your work, Scholar. Like present? Yeah. <laughs> Do I get presents? <laughs> that would definitely be... Oh, my God. <laughs> Will you give me presents? <laughs> of course. A copy of A History of Idukin, Paragon King, and Peacemaker, perhaps? <laughs> that will do nicely. Thank you. Present. Congratulations on your commission. I love presents. <laughs> That's so like Leslie. Holy shit. No, I didn't. God damn it, that's so good. I love presents! The finest in home decorations! The finest in home okay, decorations! Okay, 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 calm down. The finest in home decorations! What? what? I trust follow, big sister. How surprising to run into you out among the common folk. Especially since duty requires that you attend our King Father at the feast today. Have you so little respect for him to disregard his wishes on a day set aside for you? Lord Harrowmont told me we wouldn't be needed for hours at least. Silence! If I want the opinion of my sibling's second, I will ask for it. Hey, yes, listen! Fuck off! Yeah. Calm yourself, Peckerwood! <laughs> I know what I'm doing here! Go to the feast right now, Trian. Don't speak to Gorham like that. I go where I want when I want, Trian. Don't speak to Gorham. Yeah, don't speak to him like that. I speak to lower houses and castes <clears throat> as they should be spoken to. Now do as I say. Ooh, fuck you. Keep barking orders. I'm sure I'll care someday. <laughs> That's a Leslie answer. Your lack of a sense of duty to your house is obvious. I can't imagine why you are receiving a commission. I expect after tomorrow I'll spend much time apologizing to the heads of the noble houses for the deaths of their children under your incompetent command. That's a bit harsh, isn't it, Trian? As heir to the throne, it is my duty to impart wisdom and judgment upon those it. who need it. Now then, you, get to the feast. It's cute how you think you can order me around. I'd advise you to watch that tongue, dear sibling. Father will not live forever. Come, Balin. 
Fuck you. That was fun. Nothing like being talked down to by the next king. He is, though. You're right. Ignore him. It's my day, not his. It means well. Perhaps becoming king will calm him. He's got to be alive to be king. Ignore him. It's my day, not his. That it is. Let's get back to it. Yeah. Again, shall yeah. We? All right. Let's see. What's back here? Do we know what's back here? Aside from doors? There's a, I think there's a door I can interact with. JK! I cannot interact with it. Can I go into this door yet? Okay, I can't go, I can't go in that door yet. Look at this piece. My lady, I do can. I do Nothing here rivals your amazing I do can armor, but if you wish something made. You know very well how Saidukin has its own royal armorers. Of course. Forgive me. Show me your wares anyway, merchant. Tell me about your pieces. Your Highness's legendary prowess is matched only by your kindness. Tell me about your armor. I buy only the finest iron ore, and personally oversee the armor's <clears throat> crafting by the most skillful of the smith cast. Only the most skillful, he says. Fascinating. Thank you. Of course. The honor was all mine. You didn't nonsense, woman. You didn't your show me anything. Shame upon our house. You My lady. Literally didn't show. You honor me, your highness. Okay. All right. It's <laughs> like what? What? You can always sell him stuff. Too. Uh yeah, I can. Um we're going to breaks open in your pack it'll take hours to get the oil off of everything that no it doesn't sound good does it this blood dragon plate is worth four gold though uh, I don't really know what the hell I'm supposed to do with something like that Massive armor. Should I worry about keeping this armor, guys? I mean, to a dwarf royal family, gold is basically toilet paper, right? I don't think so, question mark? Last I checked, they weren't wiping their ass with coins. <laughs> I'll probably keep it. See how the edges are rough and pitted. Would you compare this to Bronca's work? Whoa! Whoa. Speak of things she doesn't understand. Who's Bronca? Be quiet now and pray the ancestors deliver Bronca back safely. Ooh, yeah, but who's who's Bronca? Hello? All right, no, just me. Okay. Oh, look, it's Marty. I love Marty. Greetings, my lady. May I say you look striking today. Is this your paramour? He wears both his band braces. I'm married and eligible. I'm flattered, ladies, but I'm not a noble. I'm a knight of the warrior caste. Warrior caste isn't bad. Tally, we didn't pay gold for these permits to take warrior caste. I guess you're right. Sorry, sir. <clears throat> I'd date them. In fact, that one kind of looks like you. <laughs> I mean, your arms aren't as long as hers. Because that would be fucking weird. But, uh... You know. Alright, Mokari. Uh, let's see. Are you two merchants of some kind? Why does it matter if, if you're noble, Gorham? They're noble hunters, my lady. Because a man takes his cast from his father, they hope to bear a noble lord's son. If a noble hunter succeeds, she is raised up to join the house as a concubine to care for her son. Ooh, a concubine. Brings new swords to a house, so many nobles look favorably on such women. I'm gonna get ready to go. Okay, where are you going? Out with Leslie and Sarah and Sarah's friend. Alright, have fun. Go for it. Wash the dank off you. Hey, hey. Be quiet. Favorably for such women. Um, up jumped nobles only make it or make the cast weaker.
I apologize if our presence has offended, my lady. Shall I remove them, my lady? Shall I remove no, them? No, we paid many weeks' wages to get these perm. Silence, my lady. Let them be. Thank you, my lady. Let them be. Yeah, I can go back and, and buy things. That's good. That's good. All right, so it looks like there's still like a lot to be discovered. I'll get on it. Uh, sure. Uh, sure. Okay. Actually, don't shut that, because you you make it really cold back here. I don't want it to be super super cold back here. Don't shut the door. You goon. Weapons merchant. Greetings, my lady, I do good. I am so honored to have you visit my booth. I have a proposition, but I dared not approach. Okay. Yet you dare now. <clears throat> hey, uh, Hatless, are you still there, buddy? My dude, Hat Doggle. If you take this man's face and just push it in a little bit if you just push it in a little bit you look like that this man looks like you from the one time I met you if you just push his face in just a little bit this looks just like you I mean his nose might be a little bit larger than normal but this is spot on like this is hatless hatless post a picture of you what up toys what's going on man it's alright I'll hear him out Gorm, try to be more friendly. Very well, then. Speak. I um, yes. Just so. Here's the thing. What I mean to say is... It's all right. Sorry. So nervous. I had a dagger made for you as a gift for your first command. I uh, sent a messenger to deliver the dagger to you. Prince Trian had him thrown out. I don't know what offense he caused, but I had him beaten severely. <laughs> oh, God. Um, you only had the messenger beaten? If it would please your highness, I would gladly have him killed. That won't be necessary. Then you will at least look at the dagger. Sure, of course. Yeah, yes. Here, here it is, your highness. That's an amazing piece, merchant. You do me much honor, sir. The blade has been crafted over a period of two years by masters of every art. I wish to bless the lady's first command and hope that someday, when she rules, she will wear it. Tree and his heir. He will rule when King Endrin returns to the stone. If the assembly wills it. Forgive me, sir, but whispers say the second child of Endrin will be chosen. Whispers indeed. It's a princely gift. If Trian recognizes it, though, it may send the wrong message. Or the right Man, man fuck that guy. I don't care about that guy. <clears throat> I'm doing good, toys. I'm doing good. Uh, damn what Trian thinks. Thank you. You bring uncountable honor to me. What he means is that you'll bring uncountable gold to him if you wear that piece in public. Hell yeah, let's check out this badass little dagger. Where's it at? The noble's dagger. Oh shit, it does, it does electricity damage. Yo, that does electricity damage. I'm about that. Let's go, okay. I mean, I could drop the one where Phaedra and Dickon. <laughs> yes. Yes, please. Oh, my God. What happens at Bubfest stays at Bubfest. Even my if lady, you got a dick on the neck. to the Proving Arena? Yes. What we do you ask? We have been charged with the task of escorting you to the Proving Grounds. I clean forgot about that. Forgive me, I should have informed you sooner. The king decided you were not to travel through the commons unguarded. I am quite capable of walking safely to the proving. Wait, what? Why? Will we be leaving then? Yes. We are at your command. Good. Let us go. 
Oh my, oh my God. Come to watch these brave warriors do battle in your honor. No, I've come to fight. Your Highness, this proving is in your honor. Then honor her by doing as she says. Lady Idukin will fight in this proving. I will honor today's warriors by testing their skills. All will see my glory. I just need a good workout before tomorrow's battle. I'm gonna test their skills. Of course. I'm playing well a rogue. Your I want to play an archer. Of Orzammar, we have a late entry to these provings. Held on the eve of battle for the honor of House Idukan. I give you the Lady Idukan herself. Are you ready for your first match? Oh boy. Yes. Ready. And let us Eager. begin. Hungry. This is a glory proving. Fought under the watchful eyes of the paragons of Orzammar. For the honor of House Iduken. Lady Iduken will fight Alair Bimo, youngest son of Lord Bimo. You honor me with this match. The honor is mine. First warrior to fall is vanquished. Fight! Okay. So we have dirty fighting. And we have rapid shot. Okay, let's see if I can remember this. Perfect, okay. The fact that I keep missing is not good. Pin cushion. So I gotta, I've, I've gotta turn down options, audio. There we go. High decks will land more hits for archery. Yeah. That was quite a fight. Alair Bimo is no slouch with that hammer. Are you ready for your next opponent? Bimo. Who is my next opponent? Adal Helmi, another female warrior and a tenacious fighter. Good. Excellent. Let us go. I'm ready. This is a glory proving. Fought under the watchful eyes of the paragons of Orzammar for the honor. Of house I do. Hadouken! Lady I do. Duken! Fight Adal Helmi, eldest daughter of Lady. Oh, Helmi. she's the one that just uh, killed you the dude. You are my inspiration, Your Highness, and to all of us who follow your example and live by the sword. First warrior to fall is vanquished. Fight! Someone's gonna fall and it sure won't be me! 
Just keep running! Never mind, I can't do that! You'll never hit me! I lied! You'll never <laughs> hit me! I'm missing like every, literally every shot. This is frustrating already. What does this do? I'll steal from her! Dagger, yes. Yeah. Is Lady hey, Bambi on ice or not, I still kicked her ass. You know what I'm saying? Is this gonna have electrical damage? Can I change equipment? In, in the middle of combat? I'm curious. Range 20. Oh, you have two presets to switch? Okay, all right, well that would, that's useful. So then let's go back to the Ash Shortbow. And we'll switch to the Dagger. How do I toggle that in the middle of combat? Stay a while and listen. Hey, Butter. What's going on, man? Thank you so much for the follow. Press space bar. Pauses the game, I guess. Oh, it's... The, oh, right there. I see it. Neat. I got you. I'm picking up what you're putting down. Uh-huh. That was a crowd pleaser. I can't remember the last time we had two female warriors of such skill. Sir Blackstone is your next opponent. Are you ready to face him? What can you tell me about Sir Blackstone? One of the best of the warrior cast. He achieved glory in close combat assault in the Deep Roads. All right. I'm ready. And let us begin. This is a glory proving. Under the watchful, watchful eyes, eyes of the Baron of Kozama, for the honor, honor of House, of House I Iduken. 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 Lady Iduken, Iduken. fight Sir Blackstone, Deep Road Squad Leader of the Warrior Path. Yo, this guy's a squad this is leader. Your education, Jim. Try to learn as you bleed. Ooh, ooh. Old men don't frighten me. First warrior to fall is vanquished. Fight! Fight! Okay. Okay, hit him. You don't hit. Come on. Come on, thick boy. Let's go. Come on. Come on, Cletus. Come on. What you got? Come on, Cletus. I'm just going to miss every shot? Jesus. 
Alright, maybe I should switch back to this. What do you think? Benny, what do you mean Benny Hill time? I'm kiting him around, okay? I'm wearing him out. He's gonna get tired. How did that hit me from that far? Push that back! I'll get on. Don't mind me. Fuck this shit, I'm out. Hello? You are not prepared to face me! Okay. The winner is Lady Idukin. Idukin. See, so just had to hit him, man, with a, with a rope of dope. Had to kite him around a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Well done. You have proven that even the best of the warrior cast cannot match a noble Idukin. Franklin Ivo is your know, final right? opponent. He too has had many victories today. Friendly. Are you ready to face him, or will you rest first? He is a decorated fighter who prefers unusual weapons and rarely fights with the same techniques twice. Any mods now? Just how Saivo is relatively inconsequential, but Friendlin may change that. He's expected to take I'm, a uh, I'm not running any mods. Side. I'm running basically flat off origin. Very good. Very this good. This is a glory proving. Fought under the watchful eyes of the Paragons of Orzammar for the honor of House Idukin. She cute though, man. It is down to just two warriors with backbones of. If this guy fights with a bow, I'm fucked. <laughs> they I'm have fucked. defeated all of oh. this day. Lady Idukin will fight Franklin Ivo. Second son of Lord Sword and shield. All right. And fight well. I wish you glory today and glory tomorrow. But no glory holes. All right. May you be a First stone. To fall is Later, when I meet in the back the room. Is champion. Fight! Come on, Flaccid Ivo. Wind of time on this bow is to battle. Die. It's a massacre, and no one's getting out alive. The fact that this guy can hit me from afar is frustrating the shit out of me. You asked for it. Go, oh, grab it! No, 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 no! Oh, fuck. We're gonna go to that one. Can I get you a ladder so you can get off my back? That will be your release! Can I not take that? There we go. Come on, Franlin! Let's go, Flaccid Ivanhoe! Got him! 
winner is Lady Iduken. If an attack animation has started, then it will complete. It doesn't matter the distance. Um, but I just dodged, like, a million attacks there. Like, you can... We just saw the, the health bar didn't drop. Like, as soon as he would wind up, I would just walk away and he wouldn't hit. He landed a couple, mind you, but... I think there's a point. There is a point of no return. Congratulations. Friend and Ivo is as fierce a competitor as I've ever seen. You vanquished every warrior of note in today's proving. The ceremonial helm, commissioned by your father for today's winner. Nice! Is yours. I didn't say it'll hit once, it complete. Oh, okay. Okay, gotcha. That makes sense. I misread that. That's my bad. I'll wear it proudly. Your glory honors every warrior here. By extreme exhaustion. <laughs> Oh, it's so true, though. Fuck, I can't even wear it, man! God damn it. <laughs> I can't even wear it. It's alright, though. Nice. Good showing there, my lady. You're a My lady? I'm ready to leave. Your wish is our command. Here's the helm. It's ornamental. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, that was fun. I don't know if that was what I was supposed to be doing, but that was fun nonetheless. I'm sure it'll be useful on someone. Nothing beats a good set of steel cutlery. Nothing beats a set of steel cutlery. What do you got? My lady Iduken. Iduken. You honor me by visiting my humble booth. May I show you my wares? Of course, Please, good merchant. Look as you will. Of course. Noble's clothing? Wow, he's... Wow, okay. This guy's got some muns, man. Glorious child. He's got some mad money. I'm sure that will be important in the future. But it does not seem that important right now. I am at your service. I am at your service. Congratulations on being named command. Congratulations on Bumblebee Alright, we're gonna go back in. We're gonna see what this is about. Well, this is awkward, right? I know you will do House Iduken proud. House Iduken. Probably my favorite part so far. Look, the Grey Wardens are here. Many thanks for your willingness to hear me out, my lady. I wish to speak to you of a matter most urgent. See, I wish, I wish that I could have been alive, and like in in set in my um, uh, in my sound, just for 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 an opportunity to to voice act for this. And I'd be like, well, Bob, this, this game isn't that old, but like, I didn't really define my tone of voice for a long time. And I think you can tell that when you hear me laugh because I've got this like high pitched giggle, but. I think I could have voice acted the shit out of this game. Someone make a mod, all voices are bubs. I could, I feel like I could. Man, I... One day I'll meet the right person. I'll meet the right person that, that'll help me on that journey. Oh, yeah. Of course, Lord Dace. Uh, there is a vote coming before the assembly next week. And a word from you could go a long way towards helping our cause. There are only a few hundred hours, I know, right? What cause? The vote concerns the status of the so-called surface caste. Lost to the stone, air-touched, and so forth. Centuries ago, 
Narrow-minded men declared that any dwarf who left to live on the surface forfeited his caste, and his house if noble. That he was, in essence, no longer a dwarf. I seek only to remedy an injustice, to retie the bonds of you, anyone you do sound who quite place himself drawerish. to one of the noble I'm houses wherever he is. I am a full, please, one full drawerfish, please. Please speak for this noble cause. I am one full drawerfish. Why so interested in this particular cause? Those on the surface are our lifeline. They facilitate trade with the surface. They're honorable and, um, well, let's be honest. I don't care a whit for those who have wandered from the stone. My wife, however, is a gem of a different color. She has a cousin, a useless sort, but she's quite fond of him. He joined a speculative venture to the surface, hoping to make his fortune, and went bust. Now he wishes to come home, but he cannot, for he has no house and would be castless. For my wife's sake, I Same take Savage. His calls. It's all right, random. Nobody's mad at you for it. <sighs> do I get presents? If I do this, will I get presents? I keep my ears to the stone, my lady. I hear many things, some of which could be a great help during your mission tomorrow. A little forewarning to help your forearming, if you know what I mean. Yeah, I'm about that. You have a deal. When your father presents you to the noble houses, I will ask for your opinion on the matter. You have merely to say that you feel our surface brothers should be returned their noble rights. What could be more simple? New Codex, the casts. There he is. There's the man. Duncan himself. You're a fool. Duncan. I can almost hear his voice too. Is that weird? Mm. Let's hear it. Greetings, my lady Iduken. It is an honor to meet you at last. Sagely, yeah. I can you can hear it. The kingdom runs on Duncan. The honor is mine, Warden. I have had the opportunity to recently meet with your father. He speaks highly of you. He says you may be the quickest fighter in all of House Iduken. Iduken! My father does me a great honor. We shall see what happens tomorrow. There's no may about it. I'm the best. I have no doubt it is deserved. We need more Grey Wardens like you, and quickly. Yo, that Even weapon. as the Darkspawn weakened here in Osmore, they are stirring on the surface. A blight has begun. Soon the fight must go beyond the deep roads, lest the Darkspawn threaten all the world. That, uh, that hilt and pommel, it's just badass. I do not know as much as I should about the Grey Wardens. You know of our dedication to destroying the Darkspawn, our frontline presence during a blight. What else would you know? Are there many people in the Grey Wardens? Over the centuries, many dwarves have made names for themselves in our order. These days, however, there are fewer dwarves and thus even fewer dwarven Grey Wardens. A pity, since dwarven warriors have the most experience fighting Darkspawn. What does joining entail? Being a Grey Warden means abandoning all ties to your old life. It means dedicating yourself to destroying the Darkspawn. Okay. Could I join the Grey Wardens and still stay I'm in I'm afraid Rosemar? not. Grey Wardens go where they're needed most. Right now, that is on the surface at the ruins of Ostagar, where the human king gathers his armies to face the Blight. Ostagar. I like, I like that. Ostagar. Sounds nice. Wish I could join you. Truly. Then I will speak to your father after tomorrow. Hey, Chaz, what's going on, buddy? I have my doubts he will relent, but there is always hope. Until then, good luck to you. Show the Darkspawn what your people are made of. You got it. Who are you? Lady Helmy! Your mother would melt the stone if she knew what you just did. 
No. Hush. Excuse me? Lord Dace is playing you false. Go ahead, be his puppet. Your first command will be marked by every major house turning their back on you. I'm listening. Last spring, a guild from the Merchant Cast invested heavily in an expedition with a guild from the surface. Lord Dace backed the Merchant Guild, pouring a great deal of money into the venture. The expedition was a disaster. All right. And? Let's see how this relates to anything. Lord Dace lost a great deal of money and prestige. The Surface Guild has no way to repay the investment, but it does have several leading members who are descended from noble houses. House Helmy, Bimo, I Dukin. If the Surface Dwellers return to their noble houses... You begin to see the whole picture. Your house and mine would be forced to pay the Surfacers' kin debts. It would be a great victory for Lord Dace. Seems I need to have a talk with Lord Dace. If you call his bluff, then you lose your chance to turn the tables. Let him think he has you. Smile and nod. And when he asks his question, tell him that the so-called surface cast are right where they belong. You know what? That should take Lord Dace down a peg or two. Listen, I'm, uh... I should talk to Lord Dace. You give up the initiative, but do as you must. You just let, you let me do me, okay? You fucking bag of bones. Let me do me. You tell me what to do. What up? Don't be a fuckboy. You return. Were my instructions unclear? Spoken to Lady Helmy. And what did she have to say? She said my house would suffer from your plan. I see. Some preposterous story, I'm sure. You plan to have forced my house to pay surface debts? I suppose it could. I mean, well, it's the spirit of the law that's important, right? Our poor, disenfranchised service brother. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Well, well played, your highness. Welcome to assembly politics. Now, if you'll excuse me... Not so fast, fuckboy. You've won. Don't be stupid about it. You forget who you're speaking to. This is the guest of honor and child of the first house of Orzammar. For now, we shall see what the future holds. Trian's grasp on the throne is in no way certain, and much can happen before then. Now let me be. Your schemes are an insult to House Iduken. Lords, ladies, our Lady Iduken has challenged the honor of Lord Dace. Hell yeah, I did. What's this? My little girl is already sharpening her claws. Fantastic! I thought tonight would be all talk and drink. My lady, are you sure you wish to do this? You realize that it is Lord Dace's son, Mandar, a formidable duelist, who will defend the honor of House Dace in approving. What I know of this Mandar... time champion of the Great Provings, much decorated and heir to House Dace. Bring him on. Very well. That hey, Lana, approving. what's going on? Let the ancestors hey there, judge who has the right of their cause. To the proving grounds! <laughs> okay. That moment when I might have bit off more than I can chew. <laughs> Men and women, <laughs> lords and ladies, may I have your attention, please? We are gifted to have in our presence the Lady Iduken, in whose honor today's provings were fought. Today, Having played House this countless Iduken times, I have never seen this before. Of honor against House Dace. These two brave combatants have come I'm so excited for this right now. <laughs> Lord Dace will regret his the words, Mandar. Begins now. Hold on. Where's he at? He's right there. Oh, wow. Yo, that axe hits. It fucking bangs, lad. Let's run this way and we'll switch weapons. Now's better than later. Sure won't be me! 
All right, we're gonna swap back. I'm gonna get you a ladder so you can get off my back. We're gonna swap weapons again. With the dirty fighting. Bloop! Oh shit! The proving is at an end. Vandar Dace has been found wanting by the. Oh ancestors. shit! I didn't even think of that. And okay, House cool. Dace is guilty of dishonoring House Iduken. This is my fault. My son has died defending my honor. I am sorry for your loss, Ronus. It was the ancestors' will. Yes, the ancestors. I. I'm sorry. Excuse me, my king. Oh, wow. I didn't... I didn't want to kill his son. I just wanted to kick his ass, that's all. I'm okay, except that I have no idea why I cannot log into my Origin account. It might be because of that Anthem. I don't know. Does anyone have any problems trying to log in? Um, I just made my Anthem... Anthem. Uh, origin account today, so... No. I have not had any problems thus far. Yeah, I knew I, knew I could get it. Wet bar gonna give it to you, yeah. You kicked him really, really hard, yeah. Pup realized he's been killing people this whole time. Yeah, well, when you know. this time that backswing, I knew he was going down. Mistakes Poor were made. Bastard. Still, couldn't wish it on a nicer house. Well put. Our new commander taught House Days a serious lesson. The hour is late. His deshers have waited patiently. As have the Grey Wardens. Are you ready to be presented to the heads of the noble houses? Of course, Father. So dutiful. <laughs> Very well. Let us begin. Lords, ladies, grant me a moment of your time. We are here today so I may present to you my second <laughs> eldest child. Blessed by the stone and born of the blood that ran in the veins of the Paragon Iduken. Who would pose a question? The prospective commander. Who seeks to know the prospect better? No? Very well then. The ritual is complete. Lona, I think you should just keep you trying at it. Orzammar's next commander. Tomorrow, our newest commander will lead part of a mission to strike a great blow to the Darkspawn. Sure, Not going, only buddy. does this recover access to some of our most important minds, but it also allows our honored guest Duncan, head of Ferelden's Grey Wardens, to strike far into the deep roads. Thank you, King Endrin. While the Darkspawn seem to withdraw, it is only because they are massing on the surface. This could mean a blight, and my men and I will discover the truth. We are honored to have you with us, my friend. Now. Feast, drink, and celebrate, for the morning brings battle! As for you, my new commander, find your brother Trian and send him to me. He may be watching the Provings, or getting some rest in his rooms. Dritz! Can't recall if this is accurate or up-to-date or not, but hey, it's a button, Dritz. Thank you so much for that tier 3 sub for 17 months. Let me hook you up with a character, man. Your next tabletop character is a true neutral... Dwarven Druid, actually. True neutral. Dwarven Druid. Man that is motivated by his own concerns. Of course, Father. What do you want with Trian? Don't question everything. Just go for the ancestor's sake. Says don't question everything. Alright, let's go find Trian. This has got to be his room here. Barrel! 
Hell yeah, I'm gonna search that barrel. Now's better than later. Gotta, yeah, I'll take another short bow, cause why not? Nice. Hey, oh yeah, I've, <laughs> okay. All right, I just keep taking bows. Book. Wait, what the fuck is that? Are you hearing that? Bizarre. Okay. Who's putting these longbows in barrels? This must be my much older brother's room. Enters kitchen. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I could hear it though. Like, I could hear the sound. I just don't know what I was expecting to get from it. I am proud to serve the Idukans. I am proud to serve the Idukans. Okay, there's Dad's room. Good day, I am at your service. Idukans. No, it's not in there. Can I get you a ladder so you can get off my back? Prince Balin Iduken. So you are a commander now, in name at least. Shouldn't you be attending our King Father? Father wants to see you, Trian. You two weren't at the feast. The world does not stop and start with your meager achievements. Not even tonight. Now, do you have some purpose in bothering us? Father's worried. You're too much of an ass to be a prince. You push your luck. Balin, get to bed. We have a big day tomorrow. I will see what our father wishes from his heir. All day I've put up with that. He can really grate on the nerves. I agree. And what I'm going to tell you next won't make you any more fond of him. Is this something I want to hear? Probably not. But you need to all the same. Trian has begun to move against you. I never thought his much-proclaimed honor would allow him to actually act on his jealousy. Big sister, Trian is going to try to kill you. How do you know? I overheard him giving orders to some of his men, and I was shocked. Then it began to make sense. Trian's decided you're a threat to his taking the throne. Maybe he's right. You know what he is? A dick. Yes. Okay. True. Trian's a pompous ass, and everyone likes me better. What the hell was that noise? Did you guys hear that? What's going on with this? Oh, let's try this. No fire? We're all good? That's weird. That's really bizarre. Um, I think my space heater is breaking. Okay. Yeah, not sure why. Dogs are howling three towns over now, yeah. How am I a threat to Trian? He fears what you are becoming, in the eyes of the people and the assembly. Trian's the named prince, but only the assembly can proclaim a king. It would be unusual for the assembly to ignore the king's choice, but it does happen. The founder of House Bimo became a paragon and king in one move from the assembly, and he was a commoner. That was an extraordinary case, but at least a half dozen times the assembly named I know, a man. lesser family member I or like even the space someone eater. from another house as king. Twice, it was a woman. So, Trian thinks the assembly would prefer me. Look at it from his perspective. You're more personable than we attack a dog. <laughs> you slaughtered the heir to House Dace, one of the most powerful houses in Orzammar, because his father dared to challenge your house's honor. 
If you win glory against the Darkspawn tomorrow, <laughs> it will only strengthen the case for you as the next heir. Savage, you're fucking Fiend killing Fear's me. father will replace him on the spot. If not, the assembly will surely turn against him when father dies. You know his pride will never allow him to step aside. What's your angle in this? It seems Trian has shown that brothers can't always be trusted. I am next in line. If Trian succeeds in his plot against you, how long do you think I'll live? What should I do? You're the Elder. I'll follow your lead as always. Gorham, what do you say? Permission to speak freely? Of course. Trian would make a terrible king, but no one wants to say it. He has just enough backing in the assembly to make it ugly when your father dies, but not enough to become king. Killing him now makes your house stronger and saves a great deal of bloodshed later. Very well, Trian dies. I'm afraid I must agree with you. Tomorrow's battle is the time to do it. I'll find out the rendezvous and buy you the time to do what must be done. I'm taking your place as father's second, so I'll be at hand tomorrow. For now, try to get some sleep. May the Paragon smile Oh, Brock, that's you. too real. That's too real, man. My battery is low and it's getting dark. That was most of my teenage years. <laughs> Trion and his men will clear the way for the Grey Wardens to descend into the easternmost caverns. Now I'm crying. Those caverns are still infested <laughs> by the worst of the Darkspawn. They Saint cannot the go. troops in there. Understood, Lord Haramont. We should be able to sense the Darkspawn and avoid them once the way is open. May the Paragons favor you, and the stone catch you if you fall. Come then, glory awaits! Come then, glory hold awaits! You and your men will second the king, clearing the main road. Don't you think it looks a little cowardly to allow these humans to take our place where the fighting is thickest? Are you questioning the battle plan? Of course not. I'm sure your caution is for the glory of us all. Enough, Palin. Take your men and make ready. Paramount and I need to have words with your sibling. Good luck, my sister. Your yep. father has a special mission for you. In the eastern deep roads, there is a secret door carved into the stone. The door leads to a tie, abandoned long ago by your ancestors. I don't trust Balin. The Darkspawn have made it impossible to reach it. My father believed that the shield of the Paragon Iduken remains in that tide, under the stones of the central room. We claim the shield, and glory will be yours. What else is in the Taig? My father's writings speak only of the shield. There may be countless other treasures, but only the shield matters. We've sent two scouts ahead to make sure the tunnels are cleared, but be careful. One of the scouts will meet you at the first crossroads you come to. The second will be further in. When you get to the door, use your signet ring to open it. Questions? Where do we go from there? The crossroads where you meet the first scout will be the rendezvous point. There you can present the shield to the lords and demonstrate the strength of Iduken. May the ancestors watch over you, my child. Do I have reason to to not to not like Balin? Like Balin just seems skeezy as fuck. Maybe it's just me. But he seems like super skeezy. It just seems super skeezy, man. I don't know, maybe it's just the way he presents himself. I just don't really trust it. Thank <laughs> you. 
As a noble, I would suggest trusting no one, including yourself. Everyone seems that way. You could always stabity, 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 stabity. Yes, I could. I could. Oh, I didn't even see that trap there. Now's better than later. Good multi stabity. You're not wrong. How is that burble? Lava. That'll do. That'll do, pig. Wait! Phelan, I didn't kill everybody, because this is Phelan Ivo. He just went down in the fight. I only killed the boy. I only killed, uh, Dace's son. You made it, Commander. Did you run afoul of any darkspawn? Some. A few. They weren't organized. Still, that was more than we expected. Once I finished... Well, Twig, what's going on, man? I hid here to avoid the darkspawn. Game's those going pretty well, actually. We just started. The one we want is swarming with those fiends. I was just kidding about the comment? Oh, see, I didn't know that. One sec. Give me a second, Lana. I'll, I'll check that out. Twig, thank you so much, man. That's super kind of you. I appreciate that. Very kind, man. Very kind, my guy. Uh, it's going to be a fight. Weren't you at the proving yesterday? I was, indeed. Would that I have been good enough to beat you. May today's battles bring us even more glory. I'll take rear guard. Shall we move? Nice. Franklin Ivo is now part of the squad. We should hurry. Okay, so I've got a couple of destinations, I think. Okay, so what did it say? Uh, random gray main. You just got home from work? Tweak, you gotta be jumping in games like this, man. This is the kind of shit that, that I think, the hell, I'd watch you play this. Just saying. Random gray main, your next character is... A chaotic good human bard. Ha ha ha! I meant to do that. Chaotic good human bard. Small tip, take your cursor to the skill bar's right edge. Push the left button of your mouse and move your mouse to the right. Hey, there we go. That's useful. How do I hot swap characters? Is there a way to, like, swap characters in combat? I feel like there was a way to do that. Click on their portrait. Oh, okay. Well, that fucking makes a world of difference. There we go. That was easy. So we've got a couple of ways that we can go. Well... If d, d has taught me anything, it's hug the lefternmost wall. And leftern is now a word. Deal with it, nerd. Trip triggered. I can only barely see that. I would love... I would love to be able to have my, my abilities actually work. Take all. See, we've got acid flasks. Take all. Take all. Works for mazes, too. That's part of the knowledge, man. Take that shit into anywhere. Hang on the left wall.
Okay, there was a trap there. Pause. I keep forgetting about pause. We got a scout. Okay. What up, scout? What's up, babe? I did. You want to see you? Check it. Check you out. Oh, motherfucker! She looks fine. <laughs> she looks so fine. Look at that. Look, look at her. She can get it. You're here. I thought the dark spawn had got you for sure. Yeah. Uh, no, I'm, I'm, not. I'm not that easy I'll to make kill. sure I'm behind you if we're swarmed. We want the tunnel ahead, but there are dark spawn tracks all over it. Yeah, Be careful. Leslie. Yeah, that's the name of the character, Leslie. Leslie Have you seen the tag door yet? I haven't ventured more than a hundred yards ahead. I'm making decisions somewhat based off of you as well. I'll follow your lead, Commander. Yeah. 100%. <laughs> I would defend history and I would take presents. 100%. Yeah, I definitely challenged a kid. Or I challenged a man because um, he was trying to manipulate me. And I was like, nope, we're going to the proving. I'm going to go fucking wreck you. And he's like, fine, I elect my eldest son, proven fighter, something, something days. And I was like, what? Get wrecked, kid. You can take this dick. <laughs> Fuck it. Oh, you're, you're doing a bow and arrow. Yeah. He made you an archer. I did, in fact. That's very accurate. I would not. Can I go this way? I feel like... When, when I play these, I either do a rogue or do like an axe dealer. But if IRL was an adventurer, yeah, I don't want to be in the front lines. The sword sounds fucking awful. Truth be told, I don't think I could handle being behind you knowing that you have a bow. Well, or being in front of you. If I proved myself in the proving, you should feel relaxed. I'm, I'm capable. <laughs> I took on what's his tits eldest son. Not what's his tits. Anything but what's his tits. <laughs> Dritz! Subbed up Savage Stalker. Savage. Your next character, lad. Lawful neutral, half-elf cleric. Savage. Lawful neutral, half-elf cleric. It just kind of makes you sound like a lawyer. Like the lawyer of Jesus. I'll get that motherfucker. What all do we have? We've got... It's Genlock. It's Genlock. Oh, I don't have enough dexterity. It's pissing me off. Oh, 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 and don't worry, when you go into the fade, you get an extra natural plus one to dexterity. So is he just gonna die? He will if you don't heal him. So then, how the fuck do I heal him? Okay, so can you scroll? Use your wheel. To scroll through your characters? Uh, that's not how that works. Okay, how do you scroll through your characters? You click on their portrait. There's a, there's gotta be a hot click button for it. Okay, well, let's just assume there isn't. You have to highlight their character. Yeah. And then you have to choose uh, a healing kit. So highlight his character. And then go into your inventory. This is Franlin Ivo, so... Um, because I've never played it on PC. Go over to... Yeah, that'll work as well. Because those are the the main one to use, but you can go over into the individual things. But you you need to set up hotkeys for your characters because you need to be able to scroll through them quickly. Well, I mean, I. Point me in the right direction. Okay. All right. Well, let's just hold on a second because now listening to you and trying to fight is has become yeah. You just if you want to watch. Dude, I'm so. You want to watch? Well, then you better get a computer out. I'm going out with Sarah. Okay, well, I can't have you over my shoulder barking orders at me. Dude, I'm so fucking into it, though. I need you to make a decision. Can I have a kiss? At yeah, least? of course you can. I fucking love Dragon Age. I literally spent three hours today watching Dragon Age lore at work. Well, now I'm going to play it and learn it. Oh, titties. You don't know the world you're stepping into with me. 
I mean, I married you, so I have a pretty good idea. Lana! I, you calm down, okay? She's talking about boning things over here. Lana, your next character is a neutral good half elf barbarian in Chaz Rambone. Your next character, chaotic neutral. Uh oh, roll again. Half orc wizard. Chaotic neutral half orc wizard. Chaotic neutral half orc wizard. All right. Well, now that everybody's almost died, we could use some healing here. So far, it's a little rough, if I can be honest. Things aren't working out the way that I was hoping. Small darkspawn shield. They heal passively out of comp. Oh, do they? Oh shit! That's awesome. I, I dig it. Yo, I used I used all of my healing though. Now I'm fucking SOL. Looks like someone beat us to the door. Stay a while and listen. Hey Lana, thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate fresh. that. Whoever opened the door is most likely still in there. Is there like a quick save or something like that? They've killed the Darkspawn. They may be allies. They have had an I do consignment ring to get in. F5, cool. It could have been stolen recently or generations back. Or it could be an ambitious cousin out for his own glory. We'll see soon enough. Understood. Let's move, men. Do she got booty? We're gonna save the game. Got it. He was okay. He's carrying a fancy face. That particular dwarf was about it. Mercenary, mercenary, mercenary. Okay. So glad you could finally join us. We feared you'd gotten eaten by Darkspawn. Turns out the shield isn't quite as easy to retrieve as I was led to believe. I wager you know where it is, though. So maybe you tell me where it is, and I don't let my boys have to go at you before I kill you. Who are you? How did you get in here? I'm your better, that's who. And as to how I got in, that's a question you'll have to ask the stone after I butcher you. Now where's the shield? Why don't you tell me how you got in? I'll tell you where the shield is. Bit for bite, huh? Both of us banking on killing the other and losing nothing by the telling? Very well. One of Prince Trian's men brought me this ring. It opened the door just fine. What a now cheeky where bastard. Is the shield? The shield's a metaphor. It's in all of us. Oh, she's a funny one. Just what I needed. Now kill these idiots. It's a metaphor and no one's getting out alive. Take 
Oh my god. Run while you still can. Yo, uh, Zach wasn't lying, man. That's, uh, that getting behind him? That was wild shit. Really well done. I'll get on it. Gotta love that ash and longbow, am I right? The rogue has an ability that deals backstab to any immobilized target from any direction. An ability to carry two full link weapons. Oh, wow, okay. All right, all right. The Iduken Signet Ring. Is that really Trian's Signet Ring? Yes. Trian will pay for this, Mark. My the words. first way we can hurt him is to find that shield ourselves. I thought exactly. You have your orders, boys. Can I get you a ladder so you can get off my back? And we're just going to take a look at all this fancy-ass armor we picked up. Five, one... So we have... We've equipped the ash bow, yes? Five, one, three, two, one, five, one point one, three point six. So the ash bow is a little better. So I fucking can't wear anything yet, because my strength is too low. There's like no, you're right, man, there's like no dump stat in this game. Everything's super important. What in the fuck was that? Hello? Straight up blew me back. Alright. Oh, I'm just playing on normal. I'm just putting on the normal difficulty. Not trying to do anything crazy. Are you fucking kidding me? Come on, man. Leather boots. Normal is hard? Okay. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, that the looks room. trapped as fuck. How do we get the shield? Look around. There must be a clue. You two, see if you can spot anything. This is where they die. Yeah, that looks trapped right there. I'll get on it. Press your signet ring into the indentation. Nothing happens. Continue. Hmm. It seems some of these tiles are different from the others. didn't. You just did it! No, oh, I didn't. I literally just clicked on their portrait. Oh. As suggested. Like I told you I would. I feel like there's there's a better option. You gotta be able to hit enemies and 
The lid of the sarcophagus slides away, revealing a small hollow that contains a shield of Iduken. Shield of Iduken. That's it. We've got it. Doesn't look like much. The skill of our crafters has come far since then. But still, the shield of Iduken. It's a symbol. That's all. If it helps rally the troops, it's a good thing. Where's the rendezvous? Point? Back in the direction we came from, at the crossroads. To the crossroads. To the crossroads. Okay, let's equip said shield. Or can I not do it? That would be my luck, man. To not be able to. Okay, so it's it's just a quest item. It's not actually something that you can equip. Interesting. So, Dwarf Morax. Main hand. Dagger one-handed. Four, three point three, four point six, four, three oh four. We want gray iron, yeah. All right. Did you hear that? Oh. Fucking traps, I swear to God. Who's gonna charge into combat and place a trap? Son of a bitch. Give me the Lyrian potion. Now's better than later. Now's better than later. You have to split talents up between archery and dual wielding when leveling? Yeah. When I get my next, like, points to invest, I'll take a look at each of them and see what kind of value I can get out of all of it. This seems like a game where you really have to invest in your planning. If you don't do that, you'll probably minimize your your damage count. I mean, I'm sure that there are people here that will also help me as well, so I'm not too bad off, I think. And Wizard, yeah, I'd say 19 on the die hits. I would say that's an accurate lad. Never seen the Dwarven, though? Well, I'm glad I could make this a first-time experience. Glad I could make it so. If Trian were really scheming against us, this would be the perfect place for an ambush. We've got the shield, and we're all alone out here. Keep your wits about you, then. Of course. What's that you're muttering about? Family uh, business. Huh? All right, then. Oh, yeah. It was convenient that I saw both of you out here, friendlin' and scout. Let me do this right here. Trish, thank you so much for subbing people. Wow, man, you don't have to do that. Remember, guys, today is a Patreon day. Um, everything is about getting the support that we can. Um, just so you guys know, we'll get this out first. Indigo, your next character is... A Chaotic Evil Gnome Wizard. 
You're basically Vigar from League of Legends. Um. So, uh, today is, uh, it's, it's Friday, right? We all know it's Friday. It's a 12-hour stream today. I'm going to be playing from noon to midnight. I'm going to be doing basically anything and everything that we, we can here. Um, we've already beat uh, the entire Bioshock series. Uh, earlier, we put down My Nervous Den, which is great. Uh, ooh, shit, Phelan, my bad. My bad. My bad. I must not have seen it or I spaced it. Hey, Anarch, what's going on, buddy? Your next character is a lawful neutral half elf bard. Lawful neutral half elf bard. So, um, yeah, uh, this is my last Friday. I've decided to start taking Fridays off in an effort to spend more time with my wife, my girlfriend, uh, my family, my friends, um, to get away from uh, the stream a little bit, give myself an opportunity to recharge and find some time off because I don't really provide myself with, with a bit of time off. Um, that being said, whenever we start hitting goals on Patreon, I'll start doing more days like this. I'll start doing more 12-hour streams. So when Patreon hits 1,200, our first major goal, I'll bring a 12-hour stream on Fridays back. It'll be the last Friday of the month, and we will play 12 hours of games. You guys decide what it is. You want it to be all Dragon Age, you want it to be... Um, Barbie, Girl, Dream House, you want it to be Minesweeper, it doesn't matter, I'll play it. I'll do it, we can do anything. We can make it a tabletop night, we can do whatever you guys want to, but we have to hit those goals. Every time we hit a new goal, we'll do a 12-hour stream of basically whatever you guys want. You can pick the games, and we'll do it. It's, it doesn't have to be the same game for 12 hours straight, it can be a bunch of little games in between. Uh, but the first goal is 1,200, then 14, 16, and 18. When we hit 1,200, which we're a, a bit out, we're still a bit out, um, I'll start getting you guys that first 12-hour stream. But we've got to hit those goals. You guys can check that out on Patreon.com. If someone would queue up that command, please, that would be very kind of you. Thank you, Karami. I appreciate that. Totally fine. My mage game character is currently between a technocrat that is hunting an artifact that I have in my hands and pissed off Lupine is staring at me down. Yikes. That sounds rough. Wait, did I turn around? I feel like I turned around. I 100% turned around, didn't I? I 100% turned around. Shit! Yes. It says that there was an area, but I didn't see that area. This is fine. So what happens in that scenario? Does the lupine just like crush your throat and that's it? GG, you're dead? Or do you like, is there a way to survive that encounter? How does that work? It says that there's a lot more here that I can investigate. Or I'm blind. No, it's here. Why is that blocked off? It's bizarre. The issues with um, elevation? That yeah, makes sense. That makes sense. Prince Trian. Mm, this is... Yikes! I'll trust Vala, sister. Where are the others? Hello, Trian. You and I need to speak alone. 
Anything you have to say can be said here in front of our men. Where's the signet ring tree in? I didn't wear it today. I didn't wish to risk losing it in battle. You gave it to the mercenaries so they could steal the shield. You dare accuse me of your own treachery? You have plotted to murder me so you could take my place as heir. You convinced Balin to help take my men and me by surprise. Do you deny it? You convinced Balin. It's not true. Just stop. You have gone too far this time. You are grandstanding at the provings I could overlook. That the nobles It's love not true! You have accomplished I don't trust nothing. Balin! This I have learned to forgive. I don't think you're gonna be a good kin king, but I think you're in oars am God I. Damn it. But I will rule. Nothing, not even my treacherous kin, will stop me from claiming my right. You and your companions will throw down your weapons, confess your treason, and be tried in front of the assembly. So arrogant, even it at the end. It will be your end, sister. May the stone reject your unworthy, treacherous body. Kill the traitors! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh god, okay, this is not a... It's not gonna be a fun or fair fight. Alright, so this is, a, this is a question I think begs to be asked. If I steal, right, if I steal from someone, because I haven't done this yet, and I'm afraid that I'm going to do it and it's going to fucking cause me much strife, uh, does it do anything like, is, is this like in Final Fantasy where you can steal items from monsters that aren't on their lootable table? If it's not, if it's something that's like not on their lootable table... then I don't care. If they're going to drop it anyway, it doesn't make a difference to me. That's tier 4 stealing? Gotcha. Okay. Stab. It's so strong, dude. Wounded here. Can you unspec abilities? I feel like I kind of want to go back and unspec some abilities. Hurry, father, before it's too. There he is, Balin. By all the ancestors. What has happened here? It seems we weren't fast enough. Balin was right. Yep, 
I knew it, you fucking shithead. My daughter, tell me this isn't what it looks like. Trian tried to kill me. It was terrible. Can you prove it? I have Trian's ring. Taken from the men who tried to kill me. You could have got that ring anywhere. Can these men substantiate your claim? It's true. There were men in the Taig trying to steal the shield. Sir Gorham, your loyalty makes you a useless witness. It falls to others to tell the story. You, Scout, what happened here? Trian and his men were here early. It seems they'd done battle with the Darkspawn. Lady Idukin came up to them, all friendly-like. But when we got close, she ordered us to attack. Oh my god, I knew it. Stay silent. That's a lie. You will let this man question my honor? You traitor! Stop her! Take her weapons! I think we've seen enough. No. If the scout were lying, I might have done much the same. I will not drag my daughter back to Orzammar in chains without hearing from Frandlin Ivo. Frandlin Ivo, you are a good and noble man. Did the scout speak the truth? He... he did, my lord. It oh! Was terrible. My His god, Frandlin, you cock knocker! Afterward, my lady stripped his signet ring. You treacherous bastard! Silence, Gorham! Do you have anything else to say, my daughter? How can you not see this as a setup? I want to believe that. I really do. Bind her. She will be judged before the assembly. To Orzammar. Balin, you dirty little hoe bag. <laughs> you know, I bet I bet Tolkien played this game. I bet he did. Lord Balin, Lord Baelish. Just saying. <laughs> Next to your character's portrait to level up. Okay. Okay. All right. So we got three points to spend. All right. Excuse me. Uh, George R. R. Martin. Not Tolkien. Forgive me. I I always J R R G George R. Yeah. This is just yeah. Forgive me. That was uh that was my goof. A spec and a ranger? Not yet unlocked. Okay. But I'm going to assassin. Man, that just sounds really strong. I feel like I just want to pump all of my points into dexterity because I'm not hitting at all. I feel like I'm missing my my shots almost consistently. But my cutting's gotta go up as well. Maybe just two and one. You wrecked that scout good. I did though, didn't I? Dexwell and Cunning are your primary stats. Con gives you health, but it isn't too great. Cunning lets you have more speech options. Willpower for stamina for skills. I don't, I mean, I don't really feel like I need to go 1-1-1. One, one, one. Yeah, I think I'm just going to go 2-1. Two and one. Yeah, let's just go 2-1. and one. We get one point to spend. Combat training. 
Mages can take more damage from an attack before it interrupts their spellcasting. As well as a bonus to stamina regen, mages can take more damage. Gains a combat tactic slot. This character is influential enough to convince others to change their views. Strength contributes to a more intimidating character. Where area is cunning contributes to a more persuasive character. Even during combat. So that's theft. What does this do? Top tier weapon talents. Mages can take more damage from an attack before it. Yikes! So many things I can do. Yeah, I like talking. Yeah, we'll go with that. Talking seems good. We've got a point to spend. Gives you... Oh, wow, okay. Dual weapons. There's so many options. I'm going to guess that I can run through these pretty quickly, is my guess. Yeah, we'll take Penning Shot. Okay, well. You've got ten minutes, sir. Orders and all. You understand? Of course. Leave us alone, will you? I'll please? take uh, lock picking shortly. My lady. I, I would have come sooner had they allowed it. How are you? Vine Gorham. Why is the assembly? The assembly isn't yet? going to call for you. Oh, shit. Balin has taken Trian's place in the assembly. He introduced a motion to condemn you immediately, and it easily passed. He had fully half the assembly ready to vote on something completely against tradition and justice. He must have been making deals and alliances for months, if not years. I'm afraid so. Oh, God damn it. Some of the lords, especially Harrowmont, are suspicious of Balin's instant rise to power. They are rallying, but far too slowly. The assembly has already I don't like it. both of us. I don't like it at all. What's going to happen to you? My knighthood will be stripped, my name torn from my family records. But I will be allowed to attempt some sort of life on the surface. Lord Harrowmont moved for a similar exile for you, but Balin's supporters overwhelmed him. You were to be sealed in the deep roads to fight Darkspawn until you were overwhelmed and killed. What does my father have to say about Lord this? Lord Harrowmont says the king has taken ill. He couldn't bear losing two of his children at once. Lord Harrowmont gave me access to see you so I could tell you this. Duncan and the Grey Wardens are still in the deep roads, in tunnels connected to those you are to be left in. If you survive long enough to find the Grey Wardens, you may be able to escape with Duncan. Take an exile, murderer. The Grey Wardens don't care about a person's past. They recruit for daring, intelligence, and martial power. If you can find them, I'm sure you can join them and escape the deep roads. How do I find them? They're down there somewhere. It's just a matter of surviving long enough to track them. I beg to go with you and fight at your side, but Balin's pet nobles wouldn't hear of it. I wish you were going to be at my side as well. I'm going to try to go to Denerim, the human capital. If you make it out, find me. Count on it. Our time is up. May the Paragons guide your sword and the stone hold you up. You got it, my dude. Same to you, my friend. I will always be your man, my Lady Iduken. I'm your boo, boo. They're ready for you now. I don't like this Orzammar politics bullshit. There is your prisoner, Lord Harrowmont. Having been found guilty of fratricide by the Assembly of Orzammar, you are hereby sentenced to exile and death. Your name is from this point forward stripped from the records. You are no longer a person, nor a memory. You are to be cast into the deep roads with only sword and shield. There to redeem your life by fighting the enemies of Orzammar 
until your death. Do you have anything to say before the sentence is carried out? Balin will destroy you, just as he did me. I understand your anger. You should have been allowed to defend yourself. Had I the power to stop this, I would have. Look me in the eye and tell me you didn't do this. For your father's sake. I had to defend myself. He attacked first. I believe you. That means Balin planned this from the start. Believe me, I will spend the rest of my days making sure Balin does not profit by his deeds. Your father asked me to give these to you. This sword and shield are a fine dwarven mate. Strike a blow at our enemies. It's okay, I've got seven bows. I'll be all right. How is he? How is Dad? He is old, and this tragedy has hit him hard. He will rest better now, though, knowing the truth. Tell my father I went to a warrior's I will. Open the doors and let the condemned walk through. May the stone accept you when you fall. I'm not gonna lie. I think the uh, the guys that did the, the effects in The Hobbit... I'm most certain that they played this game a lot. The dwarves from The Hobbit look so much like the dwarves from this game. It's it's uncanny, to be honest. I've been stripped of everything. Fine dwarven blade that I can't even use. Neat! <laughs> Bob already likes this game. Oh, God damn it! Please get out. There we go. All right, all right. Yes. 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 <laughs> oh, shit. Two. Can I get you a ladder so you can get off my back? I'll get on it. Just call me over. Uh oh. Watch it, Lord. I rip you apart. So that's problematic. Bad. Okay. Um, I guess I'm just supposed to kite one. Come on, 
All right, all right. Yeah, I don't know, to be honest. Where was it at? useful. Okay, so out of combat's alright. Just gonna quick save the fuck out of that. Let's go, dude. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Crummy, did something happen? What's up, Shawnee? What's going on? So you just added a term, but I don't really know what happens to promote that. Imagine that with two swords from any direction. I don't know, it just seems... Um, Well, I, I really was, like, hyper-invested. In this range route. I don't know, man. Like, is the range actually worth? It's gonna suck if it's not. I'm gonna regret doing what I've done. It has some sweet skills later on. But I gotta go through and, and do this, like, basic bitch style until I can actually get access to them, because that's gonna suck. What the fuck are you? I'm sorry, am I too quick for you? Sorry. Don't know why it has a lyrium potion. Once you hook up with Duncan, you'll be okay. Okay, all right. All I can do is stress. Okay. Can I give you a ladder so you can get off my back? Watch and 
horror as I rip you apart! Dark spawn corpse. Give me that shield. What if I'm not gonna be like, yeah, I I found all of this stuff. Okay. She got spider arms. She do. She do though. Come at me, ugly. Is that She's not backstabbing, it's just normal attacking. Get you a ladder so you can get off my back. Twisted creatures. Come at me. about your head. You shouldn't have came at me like that. It's definitely no way to get ahead in life. Berserk, he says. I can't. Requires 20 strength. Did you know that that was a Darkstalker leader? <laughs> God damn it. I thought I had another save. You can get off my back. On your charge, right? Let me see this one. What difficulty? This is normal. I'm just playing on normal right now. Problematically, I... Wasn't really anticipating. Now's better than later. Shit. There's gotta be a better way to do that fight. As opposed to just getting, like, super unlucky. They're like clown cars? That kinda felt like it. Alright, alright! Hey, I'm speaking. what's going on?
Gotta get my five gold. Can I get you a ladder so you can get off my back? Shanking that ass! Over and over again. All right. I think I spent an hour and a half at one fight at one point. Jesus. That seems a bit much. I don't know. Maybe I'm spinning a little different. No, what the fuck? Get on his rear side. The crit animations are kind of cool. I'm digging them. I'm digging them a lot, though. The crit animations are pretty sick. What up, Smokey? gonna do is save the game right there yes we are So if one sees me, does that mean all of them will see me? Damn it. Okay. A little less safe. I thought we did really good there. Okay. No. You're hopeless. I uh I can't. I can't beat him. That sucks. 
Because whatever that is over there is obviously, like, one, it's... There's good experience off of killing those fucking things. And there's probably a fairly useful item behind it as well. If I could just hit anything, that would be super useful. But I'm not going to waste your guys' time. The smaller ones are pretty weak. Well, yeah. I mean, I can try again. Here, I'll go try again. I'll try one more time. I'm not so worried about the little ones. Okay, all right. That worked out way better. Yeah, we're definitely gonna fucking save there. Let's go, fuck boy. I'll get on it. Sleeps and mounds easier now. Excellent. Dick. Hey, look at that. Nice. Let's just take advantage of that right now. Yeah, that's accurate. What does this do? Up the th oh, I forgot about the injury system in this. Look, my, my wife always told me about it. She's like, it's kind of a bitch to deal with. Small, clear fire crystal. Yeah, but what does it do? Alright, looks like it's a mage item. All right, guys, it's 520. Give me a second. I'm going to stand up. I'm going to run to the bathroom and and just stretch. You guys should probably do the same. I don't know how long you've been sitting here, but just stretch, okay? Get up. Grab a drink. I'm going to empty this drink out because it's gone. I'm going to grab a water, pee, and uh, yeah, I'll be back. We'll get more into this. Pretty